Okay, this is what we did here is use plastic electric conduit on a post instead of the metal. The metal end post is like $14. You can build one of them for three. And on the line post, they're $9. You can build them for about $2 a piece. Of course, on the top row, you use the metal, just like regular pipe. And on the end, just like a metal pipe, but everything's, everything's the same. You can see this fence worked out pretty good. You know, 50 foot out, 50 foot, 58 foot wide. You can see the plastic pipe works just fine. And this is a chain link fence. Instead of using the metal for the post, we use a plastic electric on there. It's real easy to do these. What I do is take a 10 foot section and I'll cut 6 foot off and use the off ball for the bevel bit. That's 4 foot. Then take a couple pipes and cut them up with 2 foot pieces. And then use, uh, use those for a 6 foot piece and drive in the swage and then put the other 4 foot piece on top. I did this other side all like that. As you can see that there's nothing wrong with using plastic pipe instead of metal. Significant savings. It saved almost $400 on this small fence. Now you can see here where I used the swedge. The swedge was four foot long, and then I used the two foot pieces that I cut two pieces up, two foot pieces, and just drove it on the swedge. So that's two foot in the ground, and that's that's holding it just fine. And on a corner post, you do the same thing. On the two inch pipe, take cut six foot sections and four foot sections. In the four foot section, I have the swage. And then you, again, you cut off the couple pieces and two foot pieces and you put them in top. You see, that's really strong. It's two foot in the ground. Drove in. There's no concrete. It just drive me in the sludge on it. Just like that. And then on the line post, it just goes all the way up. You can see there's nothing wrong with that. 